Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, Mar, and I am here to talk about Uncharted 3, Drake's Deception. Now, I think that Uncharted 3 is a really great sequel to Uncharted 2. Some people may like Uncharted 2 better, some people may like Uncharted 3 better. Uh, I, I like Uncharted 2 better, but one thing this game does, like, improves in a lot is the combat and, like, the settings you go to. Like... Uh, you go to, like, London, and, like, London's this really, like, beautiful and amazing place, like a London bar fight, uh, like, some desert area, and combat, like, especially if fist fighting has improved, um, now with fist fighting, it's a lot of, like, uh, dodging attacks, like, trying to get out of the enemy's grip, like, a lot of fun stuff you could do in it. Uh, they're, they're, like, very good, because of how smooth everything is now, because, like, it's more of a sequel, like, uh, more now in our time. So this remaster is, uh, definitely works better than the previous games. Um, and I feel like shooting has also been improved. Instead of the assault rifle having such a giant, like, fire, like, area, uh, so a lot of the time you're, like, missing shots, like, that's improved. I feel like it's been miniaturized and it's not, like, that big, if miniaturized is a word. Um... And so, combat's really smooth, really great, and also, enemies feel way more aggressive. Like, they're, uh, trying to flank you and kill you, and, like, that makes, uh, like, action scenes and, like, combat way more, uh, fun and, like, challenging. Um, I also, uh, really like the story and the characters. Like, a lot of the characters in it, including Sully, Elena, and Nate, are really great, and, like, some additional ones. Um, the story is always great, and the character is always great. Just Naughty Dog's specialty. But something that isn't great is the villains. And oh boy, Talbot is, I think, the main villain. Like him and Marlowe. Like Talbot pops up more and uh is uh like the final boss fight. But like he is such a boring villain and more of like Marlowe's puppet, so it doesn't make really sense for him to be the main villain. Um, and so it's like really hard to say. But he's also very just boring in himself. He like doesn't really do anything like that interesting, or he doesn't really have a personality to him to make him like stand out that much. And he's just a boring shell. Um, Marlowe, on the other hand, I'm sort of mixed about, because in ways, it's like, she's cool, because she's this ruthless person that only wants powers, or she's, like, different from a lot of the different, uh, like, villains in the series, uh, and yeah, it's like, I, I don't know, it's, she's sort of meh at the same time, because she doesn't really do a lot, doesn't get a lot of screen time, or, like, does that many interesting things, um, one, there is one villain, though, that, is like there for the shortest amount of time and yet i liked the most his name is rashim or ramiz or something like that it's a very weird name but he calls himself a pirate and he is very like charismatic and like happy all the time and like just a very joyful screen presence he's funny and enjoyable he's not like eddie raja but he's still a very enjoyable uh like villain like, to help, like, Talbot and, uh, Marlowe, and so he works well, uh, so, there's some, like, missions in this game that are really fun, I also forgot to mention, the puzzles in this game are really great, like, uh, there's, it's basically, like, the same quality of puzzles in Uncharted 2, I think some, I think quite a lot of them are actually better, but it feels like there's more puzzles in Uncharted 3 and Uncharted 2, Uncharted 2, the puzzles were good, but there were, like, so little of them. While here, it's, like, a, like a good amount of puzzles, and the puzzles are really fun and enjoyable. Um, so there's that. Uh, but yeah, I felt satisfied completing the game. It has a good ending, good characters. Um, it's mainly, like, a game that follows, like, Sully and Nate and their adventure. And I feel like it's a really great game. And... Like, I hear a lot of people, like, either this or Uncharted 1 is, like, their least favorite game. Um, and, like, I, I feel like Uncharted 1 is my least favorite, even though I really liked Uncharted 1. Uh, so Naughty Dog is, just does really great with their games. Um, and, like, I heard that some people think this game has too much padding and, like, 
like too much of like filler and i didn't really feel that like some of the chapters felt a little bit too long but none of them really had me going like oh it's taking too long except for chapter 18 chapter 18 sucked uh, chapter 18 is gonna be a drag when you reach it um but anyways i really like this game thank you so much for watching please like subscribe and goodbye